Jin dong. Um, I'm here with them. <laughs> Five, no. six. What does proud transport in Russia mean to you? I uh, think first of all is. Uh, <laughs> What's the reason for that? So, my name is Natalie, I'm from Seafarers in Russia, and I'm on the way to Brussels to support all transport workers and unions in Europe because it's very important for them. Uh, also, our union uh, is affiliated with actually to ETF, and we are part of ETF. And we are going to express our solidarity to LGBTQ This message we want to share with you. The most needed message is that we have to do something about the social dumping in the European transport. In our opinion, social dumping is affecting working conditions in every every sector of transport. Hi, I'm here with Miguel uh, from EVG. Uh, so Miguel, can you tell us something about yourself? Yes, uh, my name is Miguel. I'm uh, 26 years old. i Spanish resident here in Berlin, working for DB Fairtrip. It's a um, service company um, selling tickets for the German railway transport. And yeah, nice uh, to, to meet here, uh, some people, and to be yeah. here at the conference. Yeah, and uh, so uh, why are you here? Why did you move from Spain? Yeah, because the situation there in Spain, um, especially about um, Economical problems um, made me thinking uh, about to leave Spain and go back to Germany. That um, here in Germany has more opportunity than Spain, mm -hmm. and then I got the opportunity through the DB to make a traineeship as a um, ticket seller, and then I'm lucky and happy to. To be here. Okay, hmm? so great, yeah. Good luck for the future. Yeah, yeah thanks. <laughs> and this is the new S combine, so what's going on? This new platforms down. Hi, Andre, can you tell us something about uh, what Fred transport means for young people? What's important? Also, for me, it's important for young people that uh, young people have a chance to work in this job in the transport system, like in the sale or something, for long, long years and they have uh, contracts with a company and didn't uh, rent from another company. It's like in Germany it's a problem, a lot of people rent from another companies and they get a good salary and have a good option to learn about all these things about the transport system and yes. And what do you do? Uh, I work for the DB Vertrieb, it's a part of the DB group and we sell the tickets, make the marketing, we help the people with passenger rides or we had people with wheelchair accessibility to get trains and journeys with wheelchair accessibility or other routes with bicycles, uh, help tourists to find the best way in the city and a good price for traveling in Europe with train. Okay, thank you very much. You're welcome. Well, we had a great discussion at DB. Um, headquarters and we talked with the EBG, which is uh, one of the unions that DB works with and uh, we had a great discussion. My thoughts foremost is that we really need to plan for how to get youth uh, involved in the unions and uh, in the leading role of what the future should bring. Start! Transport in Europa. from the Swedish Transport Workers Union. I'm here with uh, Artem from the Sea Ferries Union in Russia. And what does fair transport in Russia mean to you? First of all, stable employment, reliable contracts, and of course, safety working condition at workplace. Yeah.